2015, my family and I lived in Virginia. We had a nice house, steady jobs, and our own little version of the proverbial American dream. We built several great memories there. Around this same time, as a lifelong musician, I had already been trying out a bunch of different avenues for doing music professionally, with everything from touring to teaching. I eventually got into composition and music production for film and video games, which I found to be incredibly fulfilling creatively. It also made the day job that much more stifling, so we decided as a family to look for ways to make music my day job. And we did what anyone would do in that situation. We packed up our whole house and moved to Germany. <laughs> Nestled in beautiful southwestern Germany, there's a small farming village that goes by the name of Obernheim Kirschen Arnbach. This is where we decided to make our home as we embark on this journey. I'm Steven, and welcome to my freelance life. This is behind the scenes. All right. Acoustic bass riff. Take one, and I'm not sure what kind of accent that is. That was terrible. Ha ha! Can you show us how to cook things? Mm-hmm. Cool. Yeah, I'll try. I wanna try. No, this is knives. So off I should point out, um, I am enjoying a delicious uh, Kolstreiser Keller beer, which you can see the label here. It's a wonderful German beer. Um, I don't know if you can see. Yeah, there you go. Good. One of the more interesting aspects of becoming freelance uh, that changed, I think, significantly from when we worked. When my wife and I both had full-time jobs, uh, they both paid well, but the uh, kids were in daycare all day from about 7 to 5. We both worked from about 7.30 to 5 as well, and then we got home and everybody was just exhausted. Uh, we tried to quickly figure out what to do for dinner, and that was the daily routine was, you know, kind of work, kids were in daycare, come home exhausted and try our best to quickly get through dinner so that we could just sit down and breathe for a second. Now as a freelancer, um, I've also become full-time stay-at-home dad. The kids do have school, but German school systems only go until noon. So I am taking care of the kids the rest of the time. So it's an interesting conundrum that you face because as a um, musician, there's a part of you that wants to succeed and to succeed as a musician, you have to be able to put time and energy into your work. But I'm never going to do that at the expense of my kids. My kids will always come first. And so there's this strange push and pull between uh, putting the time, energy and effort into my kids and then always feeling like uh, also like I you know, to get ahead, I have to put some time into uh, working on music and building building my career. Because there's a part of you, no matter how much you know that, you know, 
family is more important. There's a part of you that I think also wants your family to see that you're successful in something that you love to do. I want to teach my kids that they can pursue whatever interest that they want. And if they are smart about how they pursue it and pursue it with passion and energy and uh, knowledge about what they're getting into, that they can do that and be successful. And success doesn't necessarily mean super high paying gig, although that's certainly nice to have. I don't know. I haven't cracked that nut yet. <laughs>